All right, now I'm gonna show you how to make, this is magic, this is for jerk bait. So you wanna use this knot when, like for Rapala's or for baits that you need to have it loose so it's gotta move. And plus, if you have a knot that pulls down tight on a Rapala, if you got your rod tip up like you should have your rod tip up, it's not gonna be able to dive. So the knot's gonna cinch down on it and it's gonna to wanna to pull it up. So you, you want it to look, feel loose like on a jig, a jerk bait, anything like that. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna take your line, the tag in your line, you're gonna make a little overhand knot in it, just simple as that. So what I'm gonna do is pull a little slack out of here first. Okay, so there's that. <laughs> All right, so this is a little Yazuri. Razor sharp too, so you wanna be careful with these hooks. You can cut yourself or you can stick yourself. And I have uh, gotten more hooks out of me than I want to remember. So, all right, so I'm gonna put this little overhand knot in here. You know, just a regular old granny knot, just like that. Just So you don't want it to be too big. So, and so now I've got just a little straight little knot in there. See that, right? You can see it. Okay, so we're gonna run that back through the, through the eye and never ever put a snap swivel on your line. If, if I see you with a snap swivel, we're not gonna be friends anymore and I'm gonna, I'm gonna embarrass you. And if you can tell me a reason to use a snap swivel, and it, <laughs> then I'll, I'll, I'll change my mind, but I have never, ever thought that that was a good idea. So now I'm gonna take my tag and I'm gonna run through the uh, eyelet, and then I'm gonna pull it back up through that overhand knot, like this. Like I said, I'm an old man, and so things are not quite as easy as they used to be. Now look at what I've done. So I've got that little, so I've, now I've got just a, a loop in the eye and I'm gonna take this, that tag in and I'm gonna twist it around once, twice, thrice again. So there, right? So now I'm gonna take that little loop and I'm gonna run it back through there. All right, and I'm gonna pull it down tight, just like that. So now, now it's tight, I'm gonna take the tag in, I'm gonna take that excess off Just like that. See that? Awesome little knot. Now, it ain't the best knot because you know what the best knot is, the uni knot. I've already discussed that. Some people say it's a Palomar knot, but I've investigated it over and over and over again. The best knot is a uni knot. But if you want a bait, you want a bait that needs to, to uh, move freely on the, on the line, that's the one right there. I showed you how to do it. Never forget it. All right, thank you.